What's up guys, Pippi Deed here, and as you can see from the title of the video, we are doing another Loot Crate opening, and this month's theme is Rewind, so we're going to be seeing retro stuff such as uh, Star Wars and Voltron. Now, obviously I'm familiar with Star Wars, who isn't, but I'm not too sure what Voltron is, so that's going to be quite interesting to see what's in. So other than that, let's get right into the opening. Okay, so this time I'm going to be doing things a little bit differently. Um, usually I just grab the items and start showing them. This time I'm actually going to read the little uh, magazine that tells you everything because I feel like I'm going to miss out on something if I don't. So let me... Don't show this part. Don't want to spoil anything. Where's the magazine? I'm trying to find it. Okay, I can't find it, but... <laughs> It's way at the bottom and okay, so let's take out the first thing. And the first thing is oh, it's um the box is kind of like um the Nintendo 64 cassette. So that's kind of cool because that is pretty retro. It's a loot crate exclusive. I don't really know what that says. Like ESO analog 10 do. Oh, LSD, but that looks a lot like you know. Whatever. 10 do. I quite don't quite get that. Um Oh, Nintendo. My, my cameraman's telling me everything here. Okay, so <laughs> let's open this up. And I don't know what the heck this is. Oh, no. Not one of these again. Okay. God, I get scared when I have to open things like that because I feel like I always break the box. So this looks like a cassette. I don't think it's an actual game because... Do not show out of order. Do not smuggle. Do not cancel. So I think this is just like a little cool toy fire hunt game that is an awesome retro thing for people who love the nintendo 64 and i hope it's is it the nintendo 64 yeah i'm pretty sure it is so that is really cool and there's something at the bottom of the box oh I th oh my god the gun that you use with the nintendo that's really cool i don't quite know oh these are like arms and feet Oh, you give this guy arms. And it's like a person because you see the eyes. So I'll definitely be building that and show, displaying everything later like I normally do. So that's going to look awesome. That's definitely going in my, one of my shelves. So next thing from the box. Some retro glasses. Now, these would have been good for Halloween because of the color. They say loot crate. That's really cool. Uh, everything's uh, very 8-bit if you notice how the design is. So yeah, just a pair of glasses, plastic, it's pretty good plastic too, so, and it protects you from sun rays, so, if anybody needs sunglasses, I'm pretty sure they are sunglasses, but I don't know. Next we have a box with a tie on like every side, it's a black tie geek, so this might be a tie, now, I'm not quite sure how to open this, wait, I got it. Oh my god, this is awesome. Look at, I never use ties, but. It's got like, um, little like, uh, spaceships from like, the old retro games. That is really awesome. You guys can see. Wow, that's, so far so good. This is, nothing has disappointed me so far. Uh, you know, let's just get to the shirt. Uh, there's a shirt in this month, which actually, didn't think there was going to be. As you can see right here, it's a Voltron shirt. I just know that Voltron is like robots, so this is cool. A shirt. I didn't think there was going to be a shirt in this one because um, they only said that October, November, and December was going to have a shirt. I don't think they ever said anything about January, so that's kind of cool. And then comic notebook, so I, I think it's just like a little thing where you can like write stuff. I don't act, when I get stuff like this where you can like write on it, I never do because I don't wanna, I just wanna keep it like nice and safe. But I'll, I'll definitely open it so you guys can have a look at it. Yeah, it's like, it's kinda cool actually because you can like make your own comics, like your superpower and all that stuff. That's kinda cool. And then they have these things in the back that you can use. So that's pretty cool. 
And then the obvious pin that we get every month, uh, I'm pretty sure that's the Guardians of the Galaxy uh, tape, which is very, very cool because it says Rewind. It might not be actually because it doesn't say anything about it, but uh, it looks a lot like it. So the, the pins are always a cool collectible item to have because you get them every crate no matter what. And here's the magazine that I'll probably be reading after this because uh, there's definitely something that I missed. I did hear that there was going to be Star Wars stuff and I'm pretty sure I heard that it was also going to be a comic. So if you guys don't know, um, since Marvel, well Disney bought Marvel and Disney bought Star Wars, Marvel's going to be doing Star Wars comics and they have been selling like crazy from what I heard. So this is really cool. It's a variant cover of the Star Wars number one by Marvel. So that is very cool. Got Chewbacca there and uh, Luke Skywalker. So, yeah, just like the Batman one, I'm not going to be like uh, messing it up or anything. I'm just going to keep it nice and safe. Because who knows what they might be worth in the future. So, that is pretty much it with the stuff. Uh, here's a quick look at how the box is designed. I have a feeling we won't have to build anything like uh, the previous crates. So, I, that's kind of good because it's quite the struggle to do that. But I will be putting up everything on display for you guys to see. So uh, I'll see you guys then. Okay guys, we are back with the display. It wasn't actually that hard because uh, we didn't have to build anything this time. So let's show you guys the display. Here is the Voltron shirt. There we have the pin. The very, very nice tie right there. And the box it came in. Then we have the comic notebook where you can write in then the magazine, then the Star Wars number one variant cover. Um, the box is actually designed to look like a Nintendo 64, if you guys can see that. Here's like the power button and the reset. So, and then at the back of the magazine, there's a controller you can make. So that looks very, very cool. And then the guy with legs, he looks amazing. Then the glasses, and that is pretty much it, guys. So... Thank you guys so much for watching. This has been Loot Crate January 2015 Rewind Edition. If you want to get Loot Crate, uh, click the link in the description. It uh, helps me out and you can also get a discount on uh, your Loot Crate subscription. So anyways guys, my name is Pippi Deed and I'm out.